Let's take a look at HDMI ingest and the device mode that were enabled on PolyStudio X30 and X50 running Microsoft Teams mode. So these features were added on version 3.9. So starting with HDMI ingest, um, by connecting HDMI cable directly to Studio X, in this case, Studio X30 uh, in Microsoft Teams mode. And you can leave the cable on the conference table. Whenever somebody uh, walks into the conference room and need to uh, share a desktop, all you have to do is now connect HDMI cable and instantly uh, your desktop is mirrored on the room display. Now, uh, right now, this is a mirrored image of my desktop. Of course, you can do Windows P and uh, select Extend to use room monitor as your second monitor so that you don't need to show entire desktop, but a certain application, you can move it to the second monitor and the share that way. So uh, that's supported. Now, once you connect the cable, you do have a control from TC8 touch controller. So you can stop sharing, start sharing again. So uh, very simply, uh, you can control um, the projection of your desktop uh, this way from the touch console. Of course, this works during the meeting. And I have recorded uh, a demonstration previously. And it's the same workflow. Um, share the content from touch console if you have already connected the HDMI cable. Well, when you plug HDMI cable into your laptop, then it will trigger content sharing during the meeting. Device mode is pretty similar to HDMI ingest. Uh, this is a poly supported feature. And uh, um, you can have USB cable connected directly to Studio X system. And whenever you connect this USB cable to your laptop, uh, you can use the room uh, system, uh, camera, microphone, and the speaker, as well as um, monitor, if you plug in the HDMI cable as well, uh, so that you can use the entire system for your laptop UC client. And there is a admin setting for device mode and it has to be turned on in order to use it. But once you enable it and connect the USB cable to the system, all you have to do is connect the USB cable to your laptop and instantly the system recognizes there is a USB connection and uh, it changes to device mode uh, here, as you can see. And at this point in time, I can plug HDMI cable as well, and that, that will trigger uh, mirroring my desktop to the uh, room monitor. Um, again, so that others can see, as well as you can use big uh, real estate of the room monitor in the room as well. So I'm going to uh, start my meeting. And then when I join the meeting, I can go to audio setting and the video setting. So as you can see in the audio setting, use uh, Poly Studio X30 is selected for microphone and the speaker. Now uh, on the video side, uh, you can select or you can make sure that the Poly Studio X30 is selected and they can start the video. So now, I am using Studio X30 and the room monitor for my laptop UC client. And the camera tracking is working. And uh, uh, you can change the camera tracking setting by swiping on the TC8 from the right and uh, change the camera setting as well. So you do have an access to the regular camera control on TC8. You have uh, the capability to do the uh, framing and tracking on Studio X device and uh, um, all this is available uh, to your laptop client. So that is device mode. Again, available in Microsoft Teams mode of Studio X30 and X50, specifically uh, from version 3.9.
To learn more about Poly Studio X30 and X50 as Microsoft Teams rooms on Android, please visit poly.com.